Brothers, in this religion, in this deen, Allah says to the Prophet, فَإِن لَمْ يَسْتَجِيبُوا لَكَ Muhammad, if the people don't follow you, if they don't follow you, Muhammad, here, فَإِن لَمْ يَسْتَجِيبُوا لَكَ فَعْلَمْ أَنَّ مَا يَتَّبِعُونَ أَهْوَاءَهُمْ Know that they are following their desires. So we only have one of two. Either you're following Allah and His Messenger, or you're following your what? The desires, Shaykh al-Islam ibn Taymiyyah, he said, it came in many forms. Some people's desires became logic. That was the Mu'tazila. They opposed the Quran and the Sunnah with their logic. They said that we can't reconcile between the Quran and our logic. That was the Mu'tazila. The Sufiya came and they said, Dhawq, we sense it, spiritual inspiration, our hearts, what we feel. That's what they opposed the Quran and the Sunnah with. Another group of people, they opposed the Quran and the Sunnah based on their customs. Our custom and our tradition is not like this. Another group of people oppose the Quran and the Sunnah by our madhab, our imams. They don't say this. Everyone came with their desires in different forms and in different ways. So it's either the Quran or the Sunnah you're following or you're following your desires. And the desires comes in many different forms.